what's going on guys welcome back to another video or as always if you're new here welcome to the channel today i've got a pretty cool one for you if you guys have been long time watchers of the channel you know i kind of like to keep some of my cars clean but i'm not the best at it so a company reached out to me it's shine armor and they wanted me to test out their spray wax well i've never actually used any kind of wax before unless it was in the car wash that i was using but i figured it'd be kind of cool i'm trying to get better at keeping you know the cars that we have nice anyways so i figured why not i'll give it a shot and yes they did send it to me but i'll let you guys know if it's if it's bad or if it's good or what so what i'm going to do today is i'm going to go ahead and wash the jeep up because it's about really the nicest shiniest car that we have so i'm gonna wash it up use some of that spray wax on it show you guys what it looks like after and let you know how it turns out so let's go all right guys so car's all washed up i'm gonna get the spray wax off the back of the truck and bring it over here and buff a little bit of it and see what happens all right so this is what they sent me this shine armor spray wax and then they also sent me two microfiber towels so thanks for that you never have too many microfibers but the instructions say to spray it on to a clean damp microfiber so I'll probably go run this under some water a little bit and then onto the surface of what we're working with. So obviously it's going to be this for right now and then gently wipe the surface with the first pre-wetted folded cloth. So that'll be this one. And then as soon as we wipe with this one, we're going to switch to this dry one and wipe it down. Say to use it in three by three little squares. So, and then we'll do that all over the rest of the car until the whole thing's coated in this stuff but like i said first i'm going to want to focus here just see how it works on this little area so i'm going to go damp this real quick and i'll be right back all right so now my cloth is damp i'm going to spray this let's just do a couple little pumps should be good and then little pumps there and then I don't I'm not 100% sure exactly how to wipe this but everywhere I've seen it says do circular motions so I get it like that and we'll go ahead and switch to our dry folded one and then wipe until the haze is gone and it says in the instructions to make sure not to let it dry on the car. I'm sure it'll probably leave like a weird film if you do. Just buff it out. All right, so I man, I just wiped all that down. I mean, it looks looks good. It feels real nice. It feels real smooth, especially compared to this. Like I wonder like how it's kind of sticking there. Oh yeah, that's definitely pretty cool. I want to be careful not to scratch the paint up with this, but I mean, it's pretty pretty round, so it should be all right. But you get it kind of sticky here. And from where it's right here, just so that should protect the paint really, really nice. So, I'm gonna get to doing this all over the rest of the car, and then that'll pretty much be it. So, after I'm done, I'll come back, kind of sh share what I think about it. Alright guys, so car's done. 
cars all shined up really really nice and it was a bit of a bit of a workout scrubbing in circles and i feel like i may have used more than i was supposed to but i mean really i barely used see if you can see i barely used any in this bottle i think it was like up to here when i started now it's like right to here and i shined this whole thing even like the top i didn't do any of the windows because like i said i'm not real good with this stuff yet and i don't know if you're supposed to wax windows but i didn't do any of the windows but i did do all the side the roof the back the front obviously and it looks really good and it feels smooth as all get out like i've never never felt paint like that which is weird but i mean it's done i really really actually like this stuff like i said it's the first time i've really used anything like this and i think it's pretty good pretty good product to use i might upload a update later like in a week or so see how it's still doing if it's still holding up how it does and i'll let you guys know but for right now i think that's gonna wrap it up for this video guys before i leave i do have a discount code if you guys want to go pick some of this up or any other other cleaning products i think i'm going to because i don't really have like a dedicated car wash brand or anything i just kind of go to the walmart pick some up but i can get a discount on that stuff so i think i'm gonna go pick up some more other stuff and you'll see me washing washing the rest of the cars with probably some of that stuff so i have a link in the description below to their site if you use the promo code zptv20 that's all caps ZPTV20. I'll leave that up there so you can see it. At checkout, it'll save you 20. I think it's like 20%. It'll save you some money. And you get great, great cleaning products. So, like I said, I'll definitely be posting an update on how this holds up. And I'm pretty interested to see myself how it holds up. So, drop a like on this video if you liked it if you want to see more stuff like this hit that subscribe button and uh, obviously comment down below any questions concerns that you may have and definitely go check out shinearmor.com and use that discount code pick you up something that'll keep your pride and joy which mine's over there still getting dirty but that'll be soon very soon and i'll probably be using this stuff to clean it so definitely go check out their site use my discount code save you some money and Keep your stuff looking clean. So again, that's going to wrap up this video, guys. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you next time.